Hey, welcome back to Rob's Garage. We're working today. We're going to fix this water heater. Actually, I've already fixed it, but I'm going to show you how we did that. Um, I needed to clean the flame sensor, and it's pretty easy. So, what's happening is our hot water heater is turning off and on, off and on, off and on. Probably needs a flame sensor cleaned. So, pop this off. So we're going to take out our handy dandy um, retract a bit screwdriver. These are really great for your house um, because they're just really handy. Uh, so you open it, here's your quarter inch, close it up, and it's the larger Robertson has the uh, adapter on it. So you just put that on, and then you can take these out. Unscrew these. I'll use those. And there is our flame sensor. So it has a flashlight in it too. <laughs> Pretty handy. So All right, so I've got a chunk of 220 grit sandpaper and the copper wire that's in there. I'm going to sand that copper wire until it shines again, and then this should fire up. So. All right, so now we're going to do turn that off. It has a little switch on the side here. Turn that off. Close that up. We're going to put everything back together. <clears throat> Alright, so we're going to plug this back in, and this is the power vent, plug that back in, and out of the way, now you can hear it turning on, you're starting up inside, and then you give it a minute here, the flame should turn on, and then it will sense the flame or it won't it will turn back off. So it should start right about now, I think. There we are. So the flame is going at the bottom. 